Hello everyone, in this video I'm explaining how to create bills in Zoho Books from Zoho CRM. As you know that for creating a function you're going to the settings then coming here uh, clicking in the function and then name the function and then like the type of the function for this purpose or means automation that I have, I have already created the function and step by step I'm explaining all the things that uh, right now I just statically use a vendor ID from the contacts of Zoho Books. So first you need to map the variables first. Uh, the variable name should be anything like uh, for me it's build created in the map and the required field that you need vendor id and bill number if you want to use the price list also i will use this price list also uh, but this is not mandatory as per the documentation of zoho for the creating bills the odd scope is uh, zoho books bills create and the required apis means uh, this required vendor id and the line items uh, yeah org id also required to put yeah line items it's in, in the array and this is required field because uh, you want to add the items inside that should goes to the like bill so <clears throat> Here, putting uh, the in the this variable, the vendor ID and statically a vendor ID and the bill number. This bill number is I will uh, explain in the next video how to make this dynamically. But for the bill number, you can put like the vendor name also here, and then do the other things. Uh, for now, I will comment this part. And inside the list, you will map another these two items and adding like in the line items, I will add this variable. So simple dot put. And this is the API name and the quantity like 20, 2, 1, anything like. And this uh, item ID means the API name from the box and this is the id this is statically i add but i will explain in the next video is how to make it this dynamically and how to make it nicer and other things like so and also this map the second item here adding and in the bill created put line items with line items layer and then the response it's simply uh, creating record and the bills this is the org id from this variable and this is the connection that i just create and the scope is this one as per the documentation of zoho because connection you have required to create bills where is the connection? Okay. Yeah. Connection is bills created. So it's already done. And then for response. And save and execute. So bill <coughs> is created, as you can see, and I'm going to check in the Zoho books. Yeah, as you can see, this new bill is created and the items also here is added. So I want to apply the price list that price is 400 300 after applying this price list the price is 
going decrease so simply here I'm adding statically like the price ID here for this vendor that I have, I have already set so I'm changing this bell number and save and execute again to create another bill and compare to show to you like the difference here I make refresh bills yeah this one the old one is price is 400 and 300 quantities one quantity is the same but price is the new one I just apply the price list it's uh, less so the price list had it here and the 400 300 let's see 250 250 because the price list is added and it's working and I'll explain one by one like how you make dynamically how you create record fetch record and uh, get records uh, in the next video I will explain fully how to search records from uh, Zoho books specifically like if you want search a specific field and loop it and add it to the other conditions uh, please watch my videos and subscribe to my channel then you'll get all the information and other fully explaining about Zoho uh, Zoho Deluge specifically so I will post regular uh, every week one video and fully explaining the all the things uh, thank you bye